Hello everyone, so a lot of things been happening. Community transmission of General Grievous. Dennis has taken over the EA Dice account, but it may have changed by now. Um, a lot, honestly a lot has happened. So today this is a Battlefront 2 special episode of Addy's Hat Gaming Time, and I'm hoping to do a regular one. Please know I will be missing some things out and I do not plan to add things at the last minute so the other stuff that I miss out may be put in the main episode where we cover more than one game. Here's the intro. Okay, so before we begin, we're going to be doing this differently. I'm going to be talking about some stuff. I may be pausing, doing this, and yeah. And again, the reason why I didn't talk about the newest article that came out and the newest two of them is because a lot has been going on and I cannot fit them in, but I do plan to talk about one of them in a future episode. First, the October updates will include, obviously, General Grievous and the N1 Naboo Starfighter to Hero Starfighters. And also it will include some couple of tweaks to the game like usual and including the Hero Health Card changes. General Grievous will be having skins Jedi Hunter by default and battle damage. Now, for this one, you can either pay 20,000 credits or 500 crystals. That's the microtransaction part to it. Now, General Grievous will cost 35,000 credits, including the Clone Wars era playlist will be returning for Heroes versus villains and hero showdown assuming around this time on the 30th also his abilities will be fresh shirts claw wash and unwarranted advance sorry and then also now we're going to talk about the images let's talk about the main one so the main image that you've seen now is General Grievous. Now what is in the background, you could assume, oh, this is Castle. No, 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 no. This is Geonosis. This is our official first look at it. It is, including with some droids. One of them looks like to be, could this be a new skin that for November? Um, and there's a lot of stuff in the background that you can spot that you could recognize from attack of the clones so i do like this one next image this next image is with grievous in his battle damage look now many people have theorized this is after if he would say alive after obi-wan killed grievous now the skin looks good this does and then finally the jedi hunter one is the one that you saw in the main other image and the leak one with all of his four lightsabers and honestly i feel like this will be cool okay now i'm gonna do this first i'm gonna show you the star cards the milestones and victory poses these are all descriptions from the community transmission from the battlefront and also from the battlefront 2 website for more articles they have posted so here they are on screen for you now to my collection. You must realize you are doomed. 
Now we're going into other stuff we are. So, a new article got posted. This one was about the living world and it was talking about the creatures of what you see. Like for instance on Endor, you see Ewoks you do. From Tatooine, Mosaic Slayer, you see different you see people running about, scared, and then on Genosis you will be seeing the Genosians you will be. So, it's, this article is one of the articles that I do want to read in the future, and it honestly looks very cool to hear about all this interesting stuff. Moving on, there will be no roadmap for October of 2018. Um, they are also confirmed that content will continue beyond Anakin and Cam Dooku's content drop. Basically, after February, content will continue. They are not being specific, but that's that. Um, the Battle of Genosis update will be on the 28th of November 2018. Um, also, there has been some new banter that has been uploaded by Dennis himself between Obi-Wan Kenobi and General Grievous, which I'll show to you now. <laughs> the advantage is mine, Kenobi! You'd think with four arms you'd have a better grasp on reality. Your master really should have taught you not to be so impulsive. The way you have with young Skywalker! Touché. Surrender! <laughs> and I promise you will die quickly! Crush them! Make them suffer! Your screams are like music to my audio receptors! You are the bold one. Now, don't want to spend too much on this, but Geonosis has not been just leaked once, but has been leaked twice. One of them, the Star Bazaar covered, but later apologised for clickbaiting and, I don't know, just, I guess, for making a mistake. Quick opinion on that. Some of the images do, like, do look like something from a mod that like was made months ago but then some of them do look well enough to me like look in the new large scale game mode if Genosis get added to that and you're able to fly around up on the surface of it maybe one of those images could be real it's just a possibility and then from the trusted one being that just some quick information about that that Rookies will not be available as reinforcements on Genosis. At this current time, and this is the most saddening stuff to hear, that Genosis has not been made to suit other smaller game modes or even arcade, which is quite sad to hear because I honestly thought they would do this, so I'm hoping mods get onto it as soon as Genosis releases. Finally, the community events that will be happening within this Friday and one of them ending on Monday, the other ending on Thursday. Now, the community events that should be on your screen now, those are the ones that will be happening. I've got to say for one of them, I'm scared I am. And then also finally, just a quick project update. I'm working on my next stock series to be about Battlefront 2's game changes. I need to know something from you. Now, don't tell me now. Go to Twitter. The poll should be down below. And I want to know, do you think Quinn Knight clickbaits? Yes? No? I don't know. Or I don't care. Please let me know, because this will be useful research. And I do plan to make more polls against this. My opinion is... To be honest, I will defend him at times, but most of the time I do not agree upon what he says. Hey, man, <laughs> we haven't had this much news in ages. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I don't know how this will be edited, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And I know I'm already missing things out, but that'll be for another episode. Anyway. Peace guys, see ya, and may the force be with you.